listen, it ain't over till God says it's over. All right, comment that down below. It ain't over till God says it's over, period. Yo, what's good? Welcome back to my channel here. I am Maji. I am a psychic medium healer here on YouTube, okay? And today's message is, it ain't over till God says it's over, okay? You're going to keep fighting. You need to keep fighting and not give up. All right, so I wrote some notes down that I was channeling here, and I'm going to read them to you guys. If this message happens to resonate, if this is your message, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. You share it to someone else who needs this message because maybe you're about to give up, or maybe you already are thinking about it, or you just, you, you know what, you don't even have to feel that. Maybe you are in this go-getter energy, but you still are going to need this message to keep going. Because you are under attack right now. You can feel your enemies trying to kind of brainwash you into thinking to quit. And I'm hearing don't quit. Keep going. Keep fighting. Okay? So let's see. Yeah. Basically, I'm just repeating myself over here. I wrote keep fighting until your victory is won. Somebody, as I said, that is 111. Okay? Somebody comment down below if this is you. I will keep fighting till my victory is won. Can you feel that in your spirit? Can you say that with faith? Can you believe in that statement for yourself? I will keep going until my victory is won. Okay? You have a lot of people against you. You must be doing something right. And this battle is going gonna, is, is gonna to continue. The more you progress, the more you succeed, you're going to have a lot of enemies. Got a lot of enemies. You're going to have a lot of people trying to get up on that energy, okay? And so it's not going to be easy, but you will defeat your enemies. Spirit wants you to know that here today. God wants you to know here today. You will defeat your enemies. In fact, some of you guys continuously are defeating your energy, uh, your enemies, okay? As they're trying to feed up your energy. Uh, who am I talking to right now? All right, no weapon form against you shall prosper, period. You got Archangel Michael. All your angels, all your ancestors of the highest were like protecting you. I'm hearing you and what army, okay? So you will defeat your enemies and you're going to keep fighting until your victory is won. You just got to keep going. Even when you feel like you're about to give up, you got to uh, you gotta just continue, all right? Like David Goggin style. He literally is always saying like, you know, like never quit, continue. You can always do more, all right? So God is about to make something impossible in your life possible. This is why you're going to continue to keep going. Um, Spirit says you can and you will. Somebody comment below. I can and I will. God is making the impossible in my life. I mean, you have to say things with faith because I feel like this message, you're already feeling it. You know that this is yours, okay? You know that it ain't over. So many people around you try to take try to take your life and you're still here. I'm getting like a 50 cent uh, uh, Conway the Machine kind of energy, okay? These people were shot. But now they're like one of the greatest rappers. You know what I mean? An influencer. So I feel like you're on your way to becoming an influencer or you are an influencer. You're meant to do something very big in this life. You're going to be known for what you do. And I'm getting here, you're also going to be a household name. But you have so many enemies around you. You're on their attack because of people around you that are jealous. That they're not doing the type of success that you are. All right? And Spirit says, listen, you can and you will. Keep fighting. Keep praying. Keep fasting. Keep dreaming keep pressing keep progressing okay this is what i'm hearing keep moving keep living keep dreaming write these affirmations in the comments below keep pressing i will keep pressing i will keep progressing i will keep moving i will keep trusting i will keep praying i will keep fasting uh Whew. who am i talking to this is a powerful message okay i'm channeling the name or last names brown clark Tony or Antony, all right, Maeve, Moret, I'm channeling these names, all right, so let's, let's continue here with this message, God telling you here today, it ain't over till I say it's over, so remember that, like, it doesn't matter how many people target you, are wishing the worst towards you, and are trying to block you, if God wants you here on this planet doing what you need to be doing, there's nothing that's going to stop that. There's nothing that's going to prevent the blueprint. Nobody has that kind of power other than God. And so you kind of have to remember that within yourself. You could be 22 or the number 22 could be significant. I see 1010 10 as well here. Okay. 
we have hostilities. This is what I'm talking about. Look at that same weapon right here, guys. See? You you need you need to literally um yeah, I'm hearing you in the trenches right now. All right? You're you're in the trenches right now dealing with this battle, but you just need to get need to get your weapon up. Your weapon is your voice, it's your mind. It's you repelling all of that negative energy that it just keeps being thrown at you. It's you making sure you are protected with prayers. You are protected with however you feel that you can protect yourself, okay? 26 could be significant as well. But listen, they're trying to block your path to success. They're trying to block your new beginning. And they're not. They're not. They tried so many times, but still you're here. You're still alive. You still wake up in the morning and the sun still shines for you. And the moon still illuminates, okay? There's a reason why you're still here and you need to remember that. Archangel Michael showing up too with his sword. You got Archangel Michael's sword is what I'm hearing. Somebody comment below. I have Archangel Michael's sword protecting me. You might be having dreams with Archangel Michael. Okay. I'm hearing somebody could have just had surgeries around their their root chakra. Um, private area or something like that. I don't know who that was for. But you're going to recover. All right. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And then we have patience, divine timing. That's what I'm saying. It ain't over till... God says it's over till the angels come down and you know what I mean? Just be patient. Be patient because you, I'm telling you, you have a lot of haters around you. I know that. I know how it feels personally. Trust me. I know how it feels. But you need to just vibrate on that energy of love. Somebody comment below. I am vibrating up the energy of love. That is the highest energy of all, bro. Being that loving you. Look, see? Is that envy around you, y'all? Somebody comment below, Maji got the tea. They mad. Let them stay mad. Spirit is trying to communicate with you. Your soul is trying to communicate with you. It's like, who do you think is going to win this battle is what I'm hearing. The envy, jealous group, or the loving, healing group. Pick and choose who you are, and then you'll know your fate, okay? If you a hater, sorry for you, but I'm hearing tick-tock, tick-tock, time's up. Somebody comment below. The enemy's time is up. Oh my God, I'm channeling this deep. This, this haters, this hostile people around you, their time is up. And it's divine timing that is now. It is now that their time is up. And you have angels protecting you. Angels doing something and bringing karma and divine timing to these people that have been harassing you spiritually, emotionally, physically, who knows. But it's like, stop the gossip. Stop that shit already. You know, don't even mention my name. You don't know how godly my name is. And you put in that name in your mouth in the wrong way kind of energy. Like, no. So you are definitely in this energy of love fighting the enemy. And that's why love will always win. Thank you, spirit. Somebody comment below. Love will always win. Okay? That's what you need to remember. Next, I'm going to be using... Yeah, I'm hearing you're an earth angel. Okay? They're competing with an earth angel. A human with an earth angel like who you think gonna win and not just any human because we humans is dope but it's like a hater look at that look at what we have on the bottom enemies it's the enemy it's a it's a human that is already possessed by some dark entity that's literally controlling their mind they're not even thinking for themselves they're being mind controlled you feel me so you got enemies around you i'm gonna be using my chosen ones deck 144 okay which definitely you are chosen definitely you are starcy you are a healer this deck is in the description box the link to it you can also visit my shop at majigatatea.com if you like to book a personal reading or get any other service from me uh regarding this uh tarot um let's see the messages here psychic attacks there we go see Y'all already know I'm the truth, I'm the tea, I'm the greatest alive, all right? Listen, you are under psychic attacks, right? But trust me, it's not over. Sometimes it feels like it's over. Sometimes it feels like the enemy won. And it's like, you just don't know God's plan, okay? Somebody comment below, no weapon form against me shall prosper. I am a child of God, bro. I am a divine being. I am godly touched. That's your affirmation. I am godly touched, bro. You under psychic attack, clearly you're doing something right. It don't matter what you're doing. I don't even have to go into specifics since this is a collective reading. But some of you guys could be tower readers. Some tower readers here are under attack for using their psychic skills and abilities. And then we have here, not only are you a miracle, some people are jealous that you're creating miracles in your own life and in other people's lives. But now you're getting the miracles that you're giving to other people. 
okay they're envious that you are a manifester they're jealous that miracles are pouring on into their life and they're miserable they're miserable because they don't have these miracles that you do they don't have angels protecting them the way that they protect and then of course my camera stopped right there when i was preaching when i was saying the truth you know it's always gonna happen every psychic is gonna go through these trials bro because it's like nobody really wants us to speak our truth and send these messages out to you guys i'll tell you that that's always that's always tea but anyways like i was saying you're under psychic attack because you have some sort of special ability here and then we have wake up okay like you could be literally waking your soul up and now you're waking other souls up and this negative energy here don't like it okay they don't like this rude awakening that that they're having about their life i feel like um their their negative projections they're projecting on you and they don't like that you're waking them up making them realize that they have a pathetic fucking life because instead of doing something about it they're out here hating talking about you making you a celebrity basically okay but then we have success here like i said they will not be successful somebody comment below they will not be successful their weapons will not be successful their hate will not be successful period okay they need a they need a rude wake-up call and guess what you are their rude wake-up call they need to wake the fuck up and realize who they attacking is what i'm hearing they attacking the chosen one they are about to get a rude wake-up call a tower moment in their life that's like damn i should have never fucked with that person okay because they're like i said right now i'm really getting an energy like your success is going to be their karma comment that down below their my success gonna be your karma <laughs> you feel me their karma they're they're watching you already be successful obviously right they're watching you already like manifest your dreams or they can see your dreams are near it's, it's they can see you shining or you're stepping into this energy of time to shine time to be you okay hello they know you chosen and you're meant to be successful and you're already being successful they can see angelic freaking energy around you beautiful they're envious that everything you got that magic touch yeah i got the magic touch you're feeling when we're making love somebody comment below i got that magic touch Woo! look you're beautiful some of you guys play beautiful instruments beautiful singers beautiful rappers you have beautiful faces beautiful fashion uh all right and so they all hating they all hating because you're beautiful. You could be master number 33. This could be your age right now. I'm also hearing 35, 49, 20. Okay, so age don't matter, but these are some numbers coming through for somebody. I'm also getting something's going to happen in your life. Very, very big, very big blessing. Huge, huge, huge success like never seen before in 2026, okay? Um, but you have a beautiful aura. You have a beautiful soul. Somebody comment below. I have a beautiful soul. I have a beautiful aura. I am a beautiful person. They're jealous of this beautiful person. And literally, they might deadass be jealous of your beauty, too. Your beautiful hair, your beautiful skin. Shh. They jealous of your bank account. Somebody comment below. They jealous of my bank account. Why? Who am I talking to? I'm deadass about to write that shit. They jealous of your bank account, the money that you have, okay? They're wondering. They know you're making better money than before. They know your money is increasing. Your material wealth is manifesting. It's increasing. The number 10 could be significant. Okay, October 3rd. I also heard October 20th or 26th. But they're jealous that you're making money. That you're finding love within yourself. People that love you. Maybe even true love. Maybe they know you're about to get married. Or maybe you met your twin flame soulmate. Oh, you're about to. But they gonna hate. You could also have like a two two fishes tattoo around there or a dragon tattoo but you the dragon the dragons always resemble power like i said you they could they're seeing you in your power they're seeing you in your element but they can also see this sort of underneath power within you that you're awakening within you you're awakening love within your haters too is what i'm hearing because you're always in this energy of love and beauty right your name could mean love or can mean beautiful or beauty i'm also getting to check out the meaning of your name and comment in the comments below okay yeah i'm also hearing february 10th february 22 and i'm also seeing 222 here somebody's birthday here could be literally on 222 but 
the dragon. It's that fearlessness, that intimidating energy that you have right now. You on fire. Your money's on. Your money's looking good. You have prosperity. You have abundance. You have beauty. You have love. You have everything. Comment below. I have everything. I have everything I need and more. Literally, that's why they're hating on you. Your business is more successful. You just keep getting more money. Like your money just keeps increasing while you sleep. I'm, I'm hearing you're making money while you sleep, bro. While you breathe, while you sleep, while you're awake in any state of your life. I'm also getting like your beauty is under attack. They're attacking your beauty. Okay. That's why you might be waking up with random pimples, even though let's say you have like clear face or something. This is an example. All right. They're trying to attack your beauty. And, and if it's also like how you feel about yourself, like you might be waking up, maybe not feeling as beautiful as you know you are. That's how you know you're also under some sort of beauty spell here. But I'm getting they're attacking your beauty, but also that beauty that's inside of you. Like I said in my last reading, check out my latest reading. OK, it's called um, it's what you carry that they are attacking. It's what you carry. It's that love inside that you carry that they're attacking. Okay, it's that beauty inside of you that they're attacking. It's that spiritual wealth inside of you that they're attacking. It's that inner dragon inside of you that they're attacking. All right? So let me know how you guys feel about this message here. If this is re resonating with you. If it does, thank you so much for watching. Um, and like I said, if you like to book a reading, just go to my site. Sending you so much love and light. And you knowing that you was popping and that's why you got haters. Okay? Bye-bye.